All right, it's uh, honey extracting uh, day today. I've got my new uh, nine frame electric uh, honey extractor in behind me there, um, which has made the job uh, much easier uh, and uh, goes a lot, uh, lot faster. So yay, go bees, go honey. Um, this is my uh, homemade uncapping tank, uh, which is basically just a couple of Tupperware boxes. Bottom is cut out of the top one. And then I'm using a uh, stainless steel uh, utensil holder, which is just turned upside down. So that uh, keeps the wax on top and lets the honey drip through. I didn't install a honey gate on this. Um, usually you would put a nozzle here and let the honey drip out, but I just uh, scoop the honey out of the bottom and uh, and put it through the uh, through the filter. I do a very uh, light filter. Uh, I don't pasteurize my honey. This is uh, raw, unpasteurized honey. Um, but I use a light filter just to uh, keep the uh, wax uh, bits out. Um, I'm thinking close to uh, probably six, seven hundred pounds, which is which is average. I've got uh, nine colonies this year, but I had uh, six doubles over winter, so I could have done a little bit better than that. But uh, I'll take it. Beautiful raw honey. There's a lot of uh, darker honey that was um, collected in uh, early spring. I mean, this is some of the, I've been doing this for 10 years now, and this is some of the best tasting honey I think I've harvested. So, when you're uh, harvesting honey, the bees are all uh, at the window here, all buzzing around going. Smell honey. You smell honey somewhere. <laughs> 